Hey guys, the other day I just went kind of cruising around the internet on uh, a bunch of Facebook pages and also then um, some of the forums. And one of the common things that I saw that I used to see all the time, so this is a theme that's been going on for a long, long time, is left to right problems with longbow shooters. Not uncommon at all. So if you're having trouble with this, um, let me tell you first off, the longbow is less forgiving than your recurve, or especially if you shoot a bare bow or RU rig. So if you've got a plunger and an elevated rest, crazy forgiving. You've got a really heavy uh, riser or bow, uh, you know, complete, the, the whole kit is heavy, gonna be much easier. A light, squirrely uh, longbow, especially the really light, shorter ones, um, a lot harder uh, to get tuned and to, to control. So. One of the biggest problems is the release. With a longbow, look, this thing wants you to pull straight through that shot. If you plug the string on a longbow, you're gonna get left to right problems. And if you're a right-handed archer, if you come out from your face, I'll guarantee you're gonna get left impacts every time. It's gonna input into the knock of the arrow, you're gonna hit against the strike plate, the arrow is, and it's gonna go left. It happens all the time, but I've taken arrows out and I would shoot them and I would see a left to right and I would see that arrow out to the left. So I'd say, okay, that was clearly a pluck, I'll bet. And I'm talking at 20 yards, sometimes you're you know, eight, 10 inches left. And then you just focus on, all, right, all I'm worried about is form here. I'm just gonna say, okay, I've got that rhomboid engaged. Now I'm gonna start squeezing that back. I'm gonna come straight through the shot. Bam! And that thing's right down the middle. Same set of arrows, just a little pluck, and I'm six, eight inches left, versus I'm getting through off the string nice and clean, breaking, staying straight, strings releasing straight through as my fingers just relax. You know, all it is is just letting that string just slide out, right? Just stop holding no muscle tension, string comes out, boom, arrow straight as a dart. It's a good feeling to be able to get one right. Um, you can see, you're, you can shoot them like darts when you're getting off the string nice and clean. So think about it, go out, pay attention to what you're doing, film yourself, take a look at it. I've had people swear to me, oh, I'm not plucking the string, and you know, just on and on and on, and then I film them and they look at it and they're out here, you know, doing this number, letting go of the string. We want to pull that thing, get set up, engage the rhomboid, pull the elbow to the rear. There it is. I feel my back already straight into anchor. I hit anchor and I'm holding. Sustain pull. Now I'm aiming. Now I'm going to start squeezing that back. Bam. Right? The only thing is stop holding right to there. And I mean, I'm at five yards, but every arrow slapped together, they're, you know, in a quarter. And that's just, that's just getting off nice and clean. So look at yourself, look at your release, get it clean as you can, and you will be able to get those arrows to line up. I, I, it's frustrating when you know you've got the right spine, you know you've got the right, right uh, point weight, everything should be tuned, and it's not. It's shooting like you think it's stiff if you're right-handed. Uh, shooter, you know, left impacts, and you're like, there's no way it's stiff. It's probably not. It's probably your release. Give it a try.